Hey, we're look. We're at the assistant's little house. Hey, assistant, are you in there? Yep. Oh, she's in there. And you're with Waggles, right? Right. Hi, Waggles. Woo. Waggles. Waggles. Waggles took off. Hey, assistant, we've got to go to the little engineer's laboratory today, right? Right. Let me get Waggles and put him in his crib. All right, so there's what Waggles. Are you ready for Waggles to get into his little crib? You have to babysit him. You've got to babysit Waggles. All right, Waggles, you be a good boy, okay? All right, Waggles and Wiggles are your good boys. All right, sister, we need you to go to the little engineer's laboratory. Laboratory, which is set up right here, right? Right. Look at that. Pretty cool. Here's the assistant inside the little engineer's laboratory. And today we've got the Ooze Lab chemistry station. Right. And we've got our own chemistry setup. We've got lots of chemicals, which are just different colors. Yeah. We've got all of her glassware. We even have some Orbeez getting ready to go, right? Right. Ooh. So let's open up this Ooze Lab and see all the cool chemistry things we can do. Yeah, okay? let's go. Okay, the assistant's all set up. So we're going to make a couple experiments. So the first one is what? We are going to make a rainbow in a test tube. That's right. We're going to make all kinds of colors. And then the next one that we're going to make is a goopy oobleck. Right. So this is it's a real fun one too, right? Right. All right. So we're going to do our. So we'll put this one over here on that side so we can So keep we know it. we need to do that one next. Yep. Okay. So is, and look, I love these little panels we have right here. Watch. You touch them and they get all oh. They change colors, watch. It's just to move them a little bit and see, watch how they happen. Ooh. There's also some on the floor. That's Ooh. right. So this is our little engineer's chemistry set, right? Right. This is where we're gonna do all of our chemistry experiments for little engineers. Okay. And so the things that we're gonna need is we're gonna need a pipette. Okay. So I'll show the people, uh, people what a pipette is, okay? Okay. So a pipette is none other than this little guy right here. This little pipette. Super cute. So first we have to add 100 milliliters of water to our six cups. All right, assistant, right. start adding some water. Okay. So she's going to take a beaker and pour it into a graduated cylinder. Oh, okay. So that's a graduated cylinder and she's going to pour it right to the 100 milliliter line. And then she's going to dump it into the cup. Okay. Let's just make sure it's right. Oh, it's, it's going to be right on. Okay, so that is yep, one yep. cup. And then what I'm going to do, since we're going to do it like a little assembly line, is I'm going to add the color for the rainbow. Okay. Or would you rather do that part of it? Or would you like to measure the water? Um, I want to do that part. Okay. So you go on to doing... We're gonna let you dry your hands, oh, and then you can pour water in. Okay. Let me just fill this last cup. Then. And then I'll do the rest. Almost, almost, and good. All right. So. There's still a bit of water in there. Okay. So why don't you dry your hands real quick? Okay. Here's a towel, and then she's gonna add these special colored tablets in there, and this is how we're gonna get the color for our rainbow. All right. right. So here's your color. Now, assistant, the way you do it is you break it up okay. and then you put it in there, okay? So okay. break it up into a bunch of little pieces and then, and then you're going to use each one of these little tablets. And I'm going to finish putting the water in all the cups. There we go. All right. So here are the rest of them. Thanks. And so what color do you think that one's going to be, people at home? Hmm. All right. So I'm going to finish adding the water. Here's this cup if you need it. Well, thank you. So we got that one. They're actually just popsicle sticks. See right here? Popsicle sticks. So here, since you take one. Okay. And I'm going to take one. What color do you want to do? Um, I'll mix green. Oh, it I mean. It kind of looks like a light blue. Oh, it does. Tealish. All right, so before we do it again, we're going to want to wipe it with our paper towel, right? So we don't contaminate the colors, right? Right. Otherwise, they can get contaminated. So there's that. Now I'm gonna do this one right here, just to help her out. I'll do this one. This one looks like red. That one looks like orange. I don't think you got it all the way stirred up in that one, assistant. Okay. Why don't you get us that fish bowl right there, and we're gonna do a experiment while we wait for the rest of this to dissolve. Okay. 
Now, the assistant's gonna grab two test tubes. Two test tubes. So grab them. Let's get blue and yellow. Blue and yellow. She's gonna mix them into our special fish bowl. What color do you think it's gonna make? So here's the yellow. Right? So we she gotta try to pour the same amount. Yep. Now she's gonna add some blue. What color do you think she's making? Let me, I have my popsicle stick right here. So she's gonna stir it up. And it's on the green, so it makes it look like it's green. But you know what? When you lift it up. It really is green. It's still green. Add, assistant, add a little bit more blue to it. And let's see what happens. Okay. Let's add a little bit more color to it. Okay. So I'm gonna hold it up here. Okay. And if you want to add a little bit more yellow. Oh, this is going to make a dark green. Stir it up a little bit more. Look and at look at that green. green. Isn't that cool? Super dark shade of green, too. Yep. All right, so why don't we move that fishbowl, and we're going to do another one with okay. two different colors. So we got that one that's green. And then what do you think we're going to make this time? Should we use blue and red? Yes. All right, so we're gonna use blue and red. I'll add red first. So she's gonna, you can actually just hang it from your test tube clips. Oh, right here. Right there, yeah. Just push it on in. There you go. Okay. Got my red. Okay, so look, not green or yellow anymore, right? It looks different. Wait, I can just put this one back. Yeah. And now we're gonna add some blue. Hmm. Let's mix it up. What color do you think it's gonna make people at home? I know. Can you tell? What color is it, assistant? It's purple. It's purple. So we made purple. And green. And green. And we use the same blue, but we just mixed it with different colors, right? right? So just show us the colors that you have. So these are her test tubes of rainbow color. So you have yellow, and what else do you have? We have blue, red, red, and green. Yeah, so those are the colors that she has. And then we made purple too, right? Right, and, so, and we also made purple back here. There's our purple that we have. We also made purple back here. Yep. Pretty cool, right? All right, so, so now we're gonna make our oopy goop. Are you ready? Yeah. Let's make that. Okay. Okay, so we're gonna make goopy oop block. So you need 160 milliliters of cornstarch. So we already have 80 right there, or CCs. Right. So go ahead and put the next one in. You put it in a big bowl, right? Right. Like that. And then we add 80 milliliters of water. So here's our water. Fill up our graduated cylinder up to the 80, okay? Okay. Wait, where's the 80? Ah, uh, here it is. So she's filling that up, being careful not to spill it. So now she's gonna put the 80 right into the cornstarch. All right, and it says you can add your favorite food color. So what color do you wanna add? I'm going to add blue. So add blue. So why don't you add a little bit with your little pipette? Okay, let me take off the cork. Just one with my pipette? Yep, it's actually called a stopper. You wanna add a little bit more? You can add a little bit more if you want. I'll add it with the real food coloring. Oh, well, let's we'll use the pipette, because that way it'd be a little easier. Okay. And then we gotta mix it. So we're gonna mix it with this stick right here. So right. we, because we got food coloring on there. And you know what you call that? You're calling it a cork. You know what the real word for it is? What? A stopper. A stopper? Yep, it's a stopper. Whoa, it's getting really hard. That's right, so this is the oopy goop. All right, so let's get it, and we'll get the food color in a little bit. Whoa. Oh, since it, look at it, it's like, it's not quite slime, it's oopy goopy, right? Right. So let's show the people the consistency of it. It kind of looks like a, it kind of looks like a liquid. Here, put it back in there. And then hand me that popsicle stick, will you? So look, it kind of looks like a liquid, but it's not, like I tried to stick it by this in there and it won't go real well. Because it's kind of a solid. That's right. So it's not fully a liquid and it's not fully a solid. Yep. So this is oopy goopy, right? Right. It's so cool to play with. So let's Ooh. see. Look at it. And look, now it's hard. 
See, look, it looks super runny, but look, it just tears. Ooh. Look how cool it is. And we made that with 80 milliliters of cornstarch, or I mean 160 milliliters of cornstarch, and 80 of water. So it's a two to one ratio, right? Right. Look. So that's pretty And cool. it's super easy to make. Super easy to make. All right, so, so the next thing we're gonna make is called oozing bubbles. Are you ready for that? Yeah. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right, assistant, we're ready to go with our oozing bubbles experiment. So the first thing we need is we need 30 milliliters of water. So pour that 30 milliliters. into your graduated cylinder. Nice and slow. Good. Perfect. All right, so pour that into the test tube. Into the test tube. Okay, and you need 60 milliliters of water, of you oil. Mean oil. So I've got I've got 50 here. I'm gonna add a little bit more, and you've got to add this slowly, okay? Okay. So slowly add the oil to the water, and then we're gonna add our special fizzy tube. Right. Slower, slow, super slow. So she's adding the oil to the water. See here, people at home? She's working like a real chemist for little engineers. Done. Perfect. So hand me that right there. There you go. Hand me the test tube, please. So look at the test tube. It's got a two different things. It's got oil and water. Sister, which one do you think is the heaviest, the oil or the water? The water. The water, because it's at the bottom. Okay, come around here and, and we're gonna drop one of those fizzy tubes into our oil and water. So I'm gonna pick blue. So she's gonna pick the blue one. Got the blue. So there's the blue Ready? tablet. And drop it. Whoa. So it's at the bottom. So at first it's covered with oil, isn't it? Yeah. Look, it's getting darker. So it looks like the oil is starting to come off it. Look, do you see the blue coming up? I see it. So look, the little blue is starting to come up right there. Right. Whoa. Wow, so why don't we put that, we're going to slowly put that back on your test tube holder. Okay. Nice and gentle, nice and gentle. And let's watch it. Okay. Whoa. Look how cool. Isn't that neat? So whenever it, the fizz is creating carbon dioxide, which is rising to the surface. Right. Whoa, look how cool it is. Because the carbon dioxide that's coming off the fizzy is actually lighter than the oil. So that's why it floats to the surface. Whoa. Super cool. And the water is turning what color? Blue. Blue. So it's like a little lava lamp, right? Right. You can look at it. It's so relaxing. And you can see it's still dissolving at the bottom. That's right, it's still dissolving. So do you see those bubbles coming up to the top people at home? It's like it's break the bubbles are breaking through the barrier. That's exactly what's happening, assistant. So the bubbles are collecting below the oil. And then when there's enough of them to come, the air pushes through the top and all the way out to the top through the oil. Isn't that neat? Yeah, it's, it is like a volcano because... It's like a volcano almost. Because when point. enough pressure builds up, it explodes. That's right, the air is exploding through the oil. And it goes to the surface. So that's way cool. Okay, sister. So we saw lots of fun things today, right? Right. So we, we created different colors. We made some really fun ooby goops right here. And then we created, like, a, like you said, like a little volcano with the blue and the oils, right? Right. So lots of fun things. And so the this, this one's my favorite. So she really likes the, look, Oops. you can actually, like, I'm going to make an A. And then it kind of like goes It kind of disappears. So you can like look like you're drawing in it. It's, I love it. So it looks like you're drawing in it, but it's still kind of like goopy. Yeah, half liquid, half solid. That's right. 
We really hope that you liked our science experiments. Remember yes. to like our channel, like our video, and subscribe to our channel. Right, assistant? Right. Bye. Bye. Hey there, everyone. Thanks for watching our video. Now make sure that you subscribe to the engineering family so you can see lots of cool videos. In fact, there's another cool video right there. You can select and watch it. I think you're really going to like it. Is it Team Umazumi, Paw Patrol, Surprise Eggs, Frozen, Blade, Masha? There are so many videos to watch. Bye!